Hey everybody, it's Glenn back in this video as the countdown to Christmas continues in the Lego Star Wars way and following on from yesterday when we received, well frankly, I don't know what, but you guys stepped in to help me out with suggestions that it's just a made up Lego fang, then a squashed mouse droid which is one of those cute little droids in a new hope that Chewbacca scares on the Death Star. Then it was proclaimed to be the probe droid from Empire Strikes Back, which I can see where you're coming from with the dome top, but I believe that the Neutron Flow is correct with his suggestion that it's an LIN demolition mech autonomous mine layer, which is one of those droids that the jar was shuffled off the sand crawler to be inspected by Uncle Owen. Like if you point what I thought was a gun mounted on top straight up as an aerial, and that's about as close as we're gonna get. So mystery solved, Probably, maybe. And as a reminder, we've also received the Sarlacc Pit and Jabba's Cell Barge, but just what's going to be coming out of door number four. Only way one to find out, and that's to open it up. And fingers crossed it'll be something good, and fingers crossed on my other hand that it will at least be something I recognize, and it is, it's a Jawa. Nice. And it's our very first minifigure of the season. Really quite exciting. Let's open the jar up and get him built. Minifigures are a pretty simple build, so I won't need to edit any music in except for ding 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 ding. Is Spaceballs a good movie? I watched it for the first time in the longest time recently on Netflix. I wasn't convinced. Let's place his hood on there, and yes. Ooh, teeny! What a cute little fella. Well, I say little, but let's sit him next to the Sarlacc Pit. It's the Sarlacc Pit versus a giant Jawa as Jabba watches on, cheering from his cell barge. And getting a Jawa means that clearly to date we're on a Tatooine tip, so yesterday's offering must have been that demolition Minecraft laying mech thing that was suggested. And needless to say, but I'm saying it anyway, stay tuned as the countdown to Christmas continues and we find out tomorrow just what lurks behind door number five. I hope to see you then. Bye.